Ah, Little Caesars. Pizza, pizza. Well, at least you can easily afford two from this place. They are known to be quick and affordable comparing to the other pizza places. But why is it called Little Caesars in the first place? Well, the founder, former baseball player for the Detroit Tigers, Mike Illich, along with his wife, Marion, opened their pizza place on May 8, 1959, spending their entire life savings. It was located on Cherry Hill Road in Garden City, Michigan. It was called Little Caesar's Pizza Treat, according to the Detroit News. Pizza Treat and the apostrophe in Caesar's disappeared across the decades, and so did much of the original menu. Chicken, fish, shrimp, hot dogs. Mike and Marion Illich stayed, and they built their empire and their piece of the city on a sturdy foundation of hard work and pepperoni. So why was it called Little Caesars? Well, it was under the suggestion of his wife, Marion, according to MoneyInc.com. The name of the popular pizza chain was given to the establishment by Mike Illich's wife, Marion. That was her pet name for her husband. We're not completely sure why she called him Little Caesar, but we're assuming that it's because of his Macedonian ancestry. Mike wanted to name the business Pizza Treat, but Marion won the battle over that one. So Little Caesars was named after the nickname of the founder from his wife. Now that's a slice of information you can carry out. If you like this answer, subscribe to more answers on Fast Answers. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that bell.